Before we dive in to what we've had in store for this Range Rover over the last 18 months, let's set the scene about where it all began. It's something quite new. It's four cars in one. It has the comfort of a luxury saloon, the road holding of a high performance car, the capacity of an estate car, and it's go anywhere like a Land Rover. I've been buying, selling and repositioning Land Rovers for the last four years. It started as a business, but it's become a passion. Unusual, right? Because it sounds the wrong way around. I bought my first car at 17. It was a red Fit 500L, 1971. I've always had a love affair with cars and always had a flair for business from a young age. However, it took a further two years until I was 19 to realise that maybe I could combine the two. It seems completely passionless saying it, but the first Land Rover I bought was purely a business decision. There was no passion, I didn't even like the car. If you're open air types, this is the car to get you there. Hiking or skiing or just getting away from the rat race, the Range Rover does it for you. Then head for the country and the luxury saloon takes on a new character. It's unstoppable. Climbing, pushing on, up and over the landscape through every obstacle. This is real motoring. Motoring in a new dimension, exclusive to the new Range Rover. I just saw an opportunity. However, I think a lot of the time, passions grow. And after having bought and sold many Land Rovers and Range Rovers, things begin to make sense. They're perfectly imperfect. They're not refined, but they go places. The stories you can tell from being behind the wheel of one. The places they can take you. My passion now with cars is fueled by occasion, adventure, and the stories that are unearthed by driving them. There's a certain thrill of taking something that's uncherished and revealing it. We work really hard to create no-nonsense daily drivers. Cars new or old are meant to be driven and enjoyed. It's the driving that creates the memories. Look at this in the snow. Don't drive in the family saloon. Only if it's a Range Rover. Then you can go anywhere. We bought the car in the beginning of 2017 and repatriated it back to the United Kingdom. This was then where we completed a sympathetic refurbishment to restore her back to her former glory. We firstly set about acquiring some of the original Roche style wheels replacing the later Vogue styled wheels that the car had been changed to at some point in its life. The interior has already seen quite a lot of work. It has been steam cleaned to remove the debris from its past life in Spain and the headliner has been replaced as it suffered from a typical case of sagging. I hope you enjoyed this short film about our Range Rover two-door. If you'd like any more information about the car, the history or the technical details, please see the link through to the sale page and our website. Thank you.